guys so today i'm going to get ready for a date as you can tell by the title so i'm gonna do a transformation or like a glow up type of video well this is not like the regular content that i do but i think this would be fun so this is like the first video that i actually talked to you guys i don't know we'll see if you guys liked it so i'm gonna do skincare makeup and then maybe my hair and i'm gonna do these it's the press and go gel nails i never tried this before so i think this would be fun let's start with the face This is the Hyaluronic Acid Toner I feel like I'll just talk to you guys throughout this video This is not a tutorial whatsoever I'm just, I'm not really good at these kind of things But I just wanna talk to you guys and Then I think I'm just gonna moisturize my skin Oh, this is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel And lastly, the Laneige Sleeping Mask This is one of the products that I didn't knew I needed until I used it <laughs> Okay, so I think I'm done prepping my skin But this robe is killing me a bit, so I'm just gonna change And we're back Let's start with the makeup I feel like I can never introduce myself. So my name is Chloe and nice to meet you guys. Let me get my hair away from the face. <gasps> oh my gosh, I look like a boy. Anyways, I've never really used primer before, so I'm just gonna start with foundation, which I use a April skin. This is only my second time using it. Oh, by the way, my skin has not been doing great. Is it too white for me? I mean, it looks a bit like a bit too pale for my skin tone, but it oxidizes in a bit. So it's going to be fine, I hope. <laughs> well, I've always struggled with like skin problems since middle school or like puberty, I guess. And I've tried like different methods like um, going to facials and trying different products But it didn't work out for me because at one point I was living in the UK because it just for further, for further studies My skin just freaks out every time I come back to Malaysia Well, it hasn't been better ever since Well, it's never better to begin with Well, recently I've started looking at like ingredients in products and like what works for me and what skin type like what problems i have because i have like textured skin and like blackheads around my cheeks so i'm still trying to get rid of those slowly patiently oh by the way about this date i think i didn't say anything but my boyfriend and i were doing long distance right now so we're just having a date through facetime but we, I just like to look good so Next step, I'm doing shading This is the one I use You can tell I've been using it a lot <laughs> Oh by the way, I have a mirror over here if I'm looking over here Oh, another question that I get quite often And by often, I mean maybe three times <laughs> Is how old am I? Because I never really talked about that before would you like to take a guess? Okay, guess now, and then I'll reveal it. Do you have your guess? Well, I'm turning 23 next month. Okay, another question. How old did I start using makeup? I would say probably 18. I know most people, especially in Western countries, that started using makeup quite early on maybe like 12, 13 I never really got 
the time or even the chance to use makeup because first of all school doesn't let us zoom use makeup so there's no point of me trying plus like all of my friends in my school never really use makeup so i it didn't cross my mind to even like start using it it's contoured in nose I'm putting the Cupid's bow. Next powder. Oh, by the way, it's raining pretty heavily outside right now. Mm, the powder I just used is the Too Faced Born This Way setting powder. Next step, eyebrows. I've never had thick eyebrows to begin with. I'm not. A hairy person in general so it's there it's just not mm. <laughs> oh fun fact the first makeup that I did was my eyebrows next question where where are you from where am I from I'm from Malaysia so I'm Chinese Malaysian my race is Chinese but I'm born in Malaysia so yes, I do speak Chinese that's my first language Raja I'm specifically from Sabah so any Sabahans out there? <laughs> Hi <laughs> Oh, this is the glossy brow gel I don't think there's any more products in here but I'm gonna do you gonna do next next deep i have two i'm gonna start with the lightest shade on this contour um this shading palette this brown shade one tip that i learned is if you want your makeup to show up on camera like sometimes your makeup looks good in person but it doesn't show up that nice on camera or like when you're taking pictures just to do your makeup looking at your phone's phone camera so you can straight up have the idea of oh i should need more blush or like the eyeshadow should be more pigmented oh by the way my nephew is outside so He's making some noise if you heard it. I'm gonna use this glittery shade and put it under my eye. I'm just gonna leave the eyes like this Okay, now I'm curling my lashes with this thing from Muji I was a bit skeptical at first but it works Okay, mascara Wow This is the only brush the blush I have the glossy cloud paint in beam. I love this thing. What are the questions? I have a younger brother and a younger sister, so I'm the oldest in my family, and all of us live together right now. That's why sometimes it's kind of hard to vlog with my nephew around, and everyone's doing their thing, so sometimes it gets a bit loud highlight i only have one highlighter it's the glossier halo scope i love glossier it just looks natural and effortless my favorite place to put the highlight is the cupid's bow okay for looks i'm using <laughs> the nivea strawberry shine lip balm and this lipstick in the shade 83 
Okay, I think I'm done with the makeup. I'm so excited to try it, but I'm not sure if I'll like it just because I don't like having long nails to begin with, but I like how cute it looks. I don't know, I'm just gonna try it. So this is what it looks like. It moved around a bit. The only concern I have is this thumb that I have. She's not like the other girls. So I have a different... Like it looks... It looks different. Because I used to suck on my thumb when I was a kid, a child. And the shape changed. So don't suck your thumb, kids. So there's like a ton of nails in here. I think there's more than 10. Okay, I'm at the tiny little instructions. And I think I know how to do this now. Oh, this is the before of my nails. definitely harder than I thought to find the correct like the right size for my fingers <laughs> it's not working out for my thumb what the heck it's way too short it will be a pain to take off my contacts oh my gosh how did I not think of that you know what I definitely need to cut this shorter it's just not it I can't I can't deal with this length Just not used to it. I need to trim this real quick. Much shorter. So this is the final look. Yay! I have my outfit picked out, which I'm going to change later, but I'm going to end this video right here. I hope you guys enjoyed, and this is definitely a different type of video. Let me know if you guys liked it, or if you want to see more, leave it down in the comments and give this video a like if you liked it. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!